Start with your feet wider than you would for a traditional split squat. In this position, both back knee and front knee will be slightly bent. Please note that it might take a moment to find your perfect position as it can change from day to day and set to set as we loosen up and get more acclimated to the movement. From here, lower your body while slightly shifting your weight forward. The goal is to have your knee as far forward in front of your toe as possible and to get the most possible extension in the hip flexor of your back leg. This maximizes the range of motion and creates great tension to support healthy ankles, knees, and hips. If your ankle dorsiflexion is limited, it's totally okay if your heel peels off the floor slightly. This will allow you to increase range of motion in ankle dorsiflexion over time. From here, it's all about simply holding your ideal bottom position with your back knee just barely hovering over the floor for the best possible tension. 